Wow, I'm dreaming again. <laughs> oh, jeez. What in the... What in the heck? Uh... Need I be concerned? About the very... Very loud... Um, lampposts? I'm gonna turn them all on. Oh? Uh... Do we, um... Do we uh, learn about that guy at some point? I guess I can't go over there. Alright. That is pretty good violinmanship if I do say so myself. So, you know. Aha! Another lantern! And power lines to run across. Very nice. I must say. Get those birds out of here. Sheesh. All right, now the real question is, is this double stops? Oh, and an accordion. Or is it two violins? It's honestly impressive if that's just double stops. Um, I think it probably is. It seems to be just a single droning tone in the back of the high one. Once he does start playing uh, both tones. This is interesting, though. Just on, uh, okay. I feel like I've heard this before. Is, is this just the overworld theme? I feel like it's a bit of a, almost a, a bit of a disjustice to just call it the overworld theme. Wow. Tuba. Tuba toothpaste. And there's an eclipse going on in the background, it seems. Hmm. Serious lack of bass and guitar, though. Oh, sax. Okay. I must say, I do appreciate it now. Just like jump in front of the moon or something? I'm not sure. Hum. Well, let's go all the way down, why not? Since I'm not sure what else might be. Oh, yeah. Sure enough. Oh? Disintegrated. That's a bit concerning, to say the very least. I hope I see my bear friend so I can tell him I had a dream about him. Consuming my soul. Pishka, that's a bit of a trip, huh? Ah, eesh. Anyways, that's, uh, that's enough sleep for now, huh? Could play some bass, yeah. I could. Weird autumn. Weird. All right, so never mind. Ah, you should know how to play this song. We were playing it with the fellas. Should I check my? Uh, let's check my laptop. I'm gonna... Any messages? Ooh. Okay, that was the B button. I have been playing too much Kirby in the Forgotten Lands. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> Excuse me. There we go. Hey, I got sick from the mall food. It was not good mall food. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> Morning. I'm working today. Angus is out of town and I'm lonely. Okay, bye. Well, I guess we're going to go visit Gregory at the Snack Falcon. And I hope uh, we're all fine and dandy with me having completely cut out the music section because that was a song we already played and also come on you know hey mom how you doing what's good did you feel it last night 
Uh, what? There's a big sinkhole two streets over. What? We're still getting those? Um, <laughs> well, <laughs> anyways, don't want you over there nosing around. I definitely won't go nose around in a sinkhole. Get back to me when one, like, swallows a house or something. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we went, uh, to the mall. Yep. And I sprayed people with the fish found. You got it. Quint just goes there to the outlet stores up by the interstate now. You know, shoes and all that. Huh. See ya. Yep. Well, off we go. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. And the weather's crap. Oh, hey, I didn't know I could get up here. That does make sense. There are power lines. Why would I not be able to get up on them? Well, you know, I said I would go visit Gregory. So I'm gonna go visit Gregory. You know it. It's what you do. I have friends to visit. And... Um... Well, friends to visit. You know? Why the weird change in music quality at that specific time? Is it just me, or have I just not been paying attention? Huh. The party barn? It's for sale? No! Ah, oh, God, whatever. The Snack Falcon was this direction, right? I feel kind of silly. There it is. Alright. Let's say hi to Greg, then. Hey, Greg, how you doing? Hey, hey. Yep. You were thinking about going to jail? Like, like you're planning on it? I think I could break out. Maybe I should, like, test my escape skills. Um, sorry, pal. Not unless you feel like, um, freaking being able to dislocate all your joints. It's pretty difficult. A nightmare about going to jail. My cousin went to jail. My other cousin, Jen, said it was inevitable. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I am inevitable. No, go back. I am definitely inevitable. Inevitable Greg. Angus around today? No, he's off doing some stuff. What stuff? Your mom! Ha 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 ha. Uh... Just kidding, Angus would never do your mom. Probably your dad instead. Um, yeah, man, let's roll. Why not? Is he just gonna, like, take off from work immediately? Mechanics? Okay, like, game mechanics? Or, oh, dang, he's got, like, an anarchist helmet and everything. The bullet went clean through. You can still see the bullet hole there. Oh, <laughs> how did that not kill him? Must have missed all the important parts. Yeah, I probably lodged in the prefrontal cortex and just gave him emotional damage the rest of his life. <laughs> uh, no, wrong war. And wrong country. This is the, uh... Here, read some history. When did you learn all this stuff? When people kept saying it was a fascist act. <laughs> you up for crime? Oh my gosh. Really? Without me? Aw, oh, dude. Anyways. Yeah, we uncommitted the crime, too. So I guess we're gonna be committing crime today? Why are we committing crimes? They better be with both direction and magnitude. Oh, god. This is just straight up... Okay. I have too much... I have too much work to do on the thumbnail. What do you mean? What do you mean? Yeah. So we're just gonna... You brought me out here to watch me beat up a car? Absolutely. This is the Street Fighter Street Fighter bonus stage. You're not. Is this like that thing where people are all hot for car crashes? No, and I don't know that movie. Anyways. That. Well. Um, oh, we need the battery. Okay, so we're not gonna like completely beat the crap out of it. I mean, we could just like... What do we need the bat... No, I guess you have to actually get under the hood, and that isn't... No, yeah, you do have to pop the trunk for the... Not the trunk, the hood. 
I ain't in your army. You've been drafted. Oh, God. We're dr they're drafting their daughters in this world. How far they've fallen. Anyways. Okay, but what if someone needs this car? I think it's safe to say no one's gonna miss it. Oh, I guess it, I thought it was just the tree behind it. Sheesh. Why aren't you helping? I'm carrying the battery all the way back. Division of labor. You get the fun part, and I get the carrying the battery part. Okay. Alright, well, smash this car. Yep. Yarg! See, the thing about it is, is that you really, like, that first hit knocked the, uh, knocked the, um, the first, the very first hit knocked the, uh, the, the, the hood open. So, we could have just stopped at that, honestly. You gonna do the honors? Um, not unless you do it properly. Car's got a tree going through it. <laughs> if the battery's worth anything, it's still got a bit of current. Alright. You wanna do it or not? I do. Is this gonna be a fun... Oh, jeez. Thanks, I can figure it out. Gotta get rid of these leaves first. Okay, let's see here. There's the positive terminal and the negative terminal. And it would be really good to ground myself before doing any of this. Um, dear God. May, take your shoes off. Um, okay, don't take that out of context, guys. Let's just do negative terminal. Ah, crap. Yarg. Whoa. <gasps> God? Sharkle! Okay, so it's not God. What are you doing here? You've always been a good friend, May. Yes, I have. Every day you'd visit me. You'd remember to click just to say hello. Yes, I'm an excellent friend, Sharkle. Am I dead? No. Oh, okay, that's good. I just... It would suck to be dead. You must go back. You're meant for great things. Really? Not really, no. Well, no. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie here. <laughs> this is awkward. Don't feel bad, Sharkle. I won't be here long, right? Dude. Ha 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 ha. Dang, I got blasted backwards. Sheesh. You okay? Um, no. How long was I out? Like, five seconds. Yeah, it, it feels longer than it actually is. Not that I would know. But, you know. We good to go with the battery? You know it. Let's get back to the apartment. Uh, I taste pennies. Yeah, that's, um... Yeah. It'd be like that sometimes. And anyway, even if it was a fascist helmet, it's got an anarchy symbol on it. Which makes it good. Yep. At least that's what bikers said when they wore the same exact helmet. <laughs> and there's a bullet hole in it, so whoever was wearing it is dead. I'm, like, wearing the trophy. Yeah. You admit that it's a fascist helmet. No! Alright. Well, then. I just like that the bullet goes clean through. No, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Because it's not like taking a bullet clean in the forehead really, really works. What the heck is that? The thing? Yes, obviously the thing. The frog thing? The... This big robot cartoon characters? They used to have a food donkey? Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh. There's so many things I can reference freaking here. I don't even know. Dear God. Guy who locked the substitute teacher? In the supply closet. I wish I could have done that. I never took well the subs. Jeez. Survived by eating glue in Spanish workbooks. He's been hanging out the food donkey since it's been shut down, and he dug it out for him. Well, that's nice. That's the first useful thing Steve has done. Okay, okay, what do we do? We need to get this old battery into that old thing. Are you sure that the, the like, voltage is proper and the polarity is all? I guess polarity is no. Anyways, you can see how little engineer, um, electrical engineering. Uh, yeah. Too bad you didn't die on the way here. Dear God. 
killed you. It's too bad the elevator didn't fall and squash you like a pancake. Oh, dude, no, that's a phobia. It's one that makes sense at least. Well, if you're in the elevator, you'll be kind of maybe okay if you jump at just the right moment. Maybe. This thing smells. It's just how old machines smell. Yeah, um, like I said, this thing, something was living in here. Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't you stop being so negative? Why don't you eat your own neck? Okay. <laughs> no big deal or anything. Yeah, just make sure you're not touching the metal bits there on the down here. Uh, saw a shark, I think. Yep, and it told me something very important. Well, okay. True. Yeah, let's do this. Clamp it. Alligator clamps. You're gonna make me do the second one? Okay, that should have. I feel like there should have been maybe sparks if the battery was worth anything. But yeah. Are you gonna be all boring now just because you died for like a whole five seconds? Yes, I am. Some people are after dead forever, ever. <laughs> right. They either shut up and deal, or they become ghosts. Uh, okay. Carpe diem sounds like a fish. Well, anyways, fine. Now's the best part. We're gonna put this beast together. Do you know how it goes? Oh, I hope there's like an Ikea manual. Cool. Awoo. Please tell me there's an Ikea manual. Here are all the parts. Wow, so many possible combinations. Create our unique metal offspring. So we just clank these together? Yeah, slap them together, tighten some screws. What could possibly go wrong? You know, nothing. At all. Dude, you are no fun. Anyways. Oh, jeez. Okay. Yep. This seems to be going well. Very nice. I'm making joints. I think I want to take this guy and put him right here, right? <laughs> Oh, wait. Actually, that makes less sense. I do want to put this one here, right? Because these are shorter, I think. And, like, this one is short. So that'll be arms. These are legs. See? Makes sense. It's gonna be the tallest looking mother and father. Anyway. This is extremely important. Are we gonna give him a booze bottle? Perhaps a cleaver? Maybe even a can. I don't know why, but a can. Cleaver and bottle of freaking alcohol. Yeah! You know it. He's beautiful. Absolutely he is, yeah. Our beautiful baby boy. Yep. It's pretty great and all, but um, why did we just do this right now? Uh, it's already leaking acid on the carpet. And it's lead acid, probably. Um, well, I guess I'm not actually entirely sure. But if it's acid, it, um, I guess, yeah, lithium-ion batteries have battery acid. Lithium acid. Uh... Uh, yeah, I feel like the lead acid batteries are smaller. It would have been like hell to have to carry a lead acid car battery home. Days I mostly work all the time, but uh, we got plans. Right, Harbor? Since when? A year or so now. That's why we're working like seven days a week. Cool. They're gonna they're gonna move. Interesting. That's like a few months away. Yeah. Oh, okay. You should come visit when we get settled in, yeah. Um, isn't Bright Harbor, like, really expensive? Not if you live in a terrible neighborhood. <laughs> Interesting. 
It's a record stories and weird bars. It's where I got my tattoo. Yeah. A uh, sheep? Interesting. Nice. Why? Why a sheep? Tattoo guy was like all the way hot. And it didn't even hurt. Anyways. God, it's like I don't even know you anymore. All right. Anyway. Now that you're back in Possum Springs, I was like, hey, let's do some crimes again. Absolutely. I mean, how I how, how use that for, like, good. So I thought I'd bring this here for Angus. Huh. Cool. I sure hope so, yeah. Anyways, all I need to do now is turn it on. Oh, I am the king of turning things on. Anyways. This has been going on for a very long time. Yep. That is such a deal. We're gonna have a pizza party next time I die. Oh god. The side smells even worse. This is whole. I think I see it. Yeah, absolutely. Let's push the button. I could have so easily just said on the next episode. Ah god! Why do I have to get electrocuted every time? What happened? Did we have the freaking polarity wrong? Jeez. Why am I still getting electrocuted? Nerd! It lives! What? Oh, Angus is back. Angus! Whoa! How's it going, May? Um, very good, as a matter of fact. Gonna lie here for a while if that's a. Who's hey? Angus is back. Isn't that nice? Dear God, that was I freaking died tonight. Oh my lord! <laughs> what a full day. And with that, I am going to have to end it off. But until next time, like, comment, and subscribe, or I will electrocute you to death twice. Uh, fun times. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.